when the Welcome to Duloc song almost went there, and then didn't. Please keep your shoes off the grass, shine your shoes, wipe your... face. Ugh, you got me. You can't just buy superpowers. Oh yeah? Tell that to Batman. Princess Morbuck serving some truth tea. How come she has fingers but none of the main characters in the show do? She could afford to buy fingers. Dang, prime surgery. Squidward said I could help by burying myself. Please tell me this is your nose. Patrick, your genius is showing. Where? Oh. <laughs> this is why I love Ed, Ed, and Eddie. The weight of the bananas are crushing Rolf's apples. Looking for trouble? Because I'll flip you like an omelet. This is my new favorite non-threatening threat. Stu, what are you doing? Making chocolate pudding? It's four o'clock in the morning. Why on earth are you making chocolate pudding? Because I've lost control of my life. Yes, dancing. I'd like to see you dance. Okay, but it's 50 bucks extra. Ooh, I don't know if you could pay the stripper like that. If my trunk was that small, I wouldn't draw attention to myself. Ooh. Gary! Change his channel. I was just looking at the sports channel, Gary. <laughs> Wait, that's a naked sponge up there. Didn't you learn anything in college? Study later! Party now! Why did that kid go to college already? Your club is for big IDKSCs. IDKSC. Yay, I'm gonna tell mom! I was supposed to be a concert pianist. Until I realized I didn't have any fingers. Ooh, tough man. You're not too old, Grandpa. And you've still got plenty of brain cells. No, not since Woodstock. When Lil got naked in front of Tommy and he suddenly had questions. Um, Lil, can I ask you a question? Fastest man alive. Which might explain why you can't get a date. Oh, that's awkward. Nice to meet you, Robin. I'm the professor. He made us in his laboratory by accident. It's okay, professor. I was an accident, too. Uh... Uh, we do not bring this up. I lost 200 pounds with my power puff. Lost 200 pounds? I don't get it. Huh? Cosgrove, how come you never got married? I like meat too much. Oh, dang, so he's gay. Dang, I gotta find a way to lose weight fast. You and 58% of America. Called out. Marcy, I didn't know today was your birthday. Yep, I'm 18. Able to legally... Pause. Vote. Huh? Yeah, they got all the details just right. Speak for yourself. Okay, I don't think the manufacturers want to make that part, okay? You're teen titans, chill. Did you see my underwear? No, Patrick. Did you want to? It was an accident. You're an accident! Shots fired. These girls are freaking hypocrites. They were literally an accident in a freaking laboratory. Who the hell do they think they're fooling? If you want a taste of my juicy apple pie, you better be nice, you got that? Johnny Bravo knew the D meme before anyone. Is that even a meme? I, I feel like it's just like, you know, always been a reference. This was by far the cringiest thing we all witnessed in our childhood. Ugh, I forgot about that scene. Why would you have to remind me? Whenever their masculinity is threatened, they shrink in size. Hmm. I'm Mary Jane. Like, that's my favorite name. Woman on television. Roger, I'm pregnant. Man on television. That's the third time this week. Daffy reading Play Duck magazine alongside Bugs Bunny. Bro, don't you think your friends are gonna peep over? One on one hotline. Oh baby, oh baby, oh baby. Remember, be hot, be naughty, be courteous. This is crazy. Well, the reason the lava keeps shooting up into the air is because I love you. 
Ha! Huh? When Colette thought Linguini was trying to be very, very honest with her, I have this, this tiny, uh, little... Why is she looking down? Curse you, crabs! And now for the chaser. Oh crap, he's gonna, well, crap on him. This desert reminds me of a woman. Why is that? It goes on and on and on. Damn, Fred, okay. I rented you boys some movies. Reptile Comes Home, Reptile Redux, and my personal favorite, Lonely Space Vixens. <laughs> um, that's for after you go to bed. Oops. Clumsy me. Dad's trophy. <laughs> Wait, why is it looking at her like that? Oops, wrong tent. Sorry, did you need to talk to Sokka too? Nope, not me. Huh? Well, hello, uh, Zuko, yeah, why would I be expecting anyone different? <laughs> the squirrel likes to hide his nuts in many odd places, where the sun doesn't shine on them. It took me ten years to realize his head went into the shape of a leg. What, you thought he was just a weird crooked pipe? This is so much fun! I can't remember the last time I was blindfolded. Oh wait, yes I can. Oops. This illusion in fairly odd parents. I'm just gonna take these paper towels up to my room alone, so don't bother me. Oh, I'm sure they were suspicious. The three little pigs having their father hanging on the wall. What the heck? I just need something to poke in here. What the hell? So, this must be Lord Farquaad's castle. Do you think maybe he's compensating for something? I like how they did actual speech bubbles and not just subtitles. Captain, are you crying? No, I'm leaking dreams. <laughs> the note in Ed's bathroom. Don't touch yourself. Look, doubloons! Don't drop them! Double D wrote you a poem. Get lost? This show, I freaking can't. <laughs> it's hard to keep nuts in your mouth when you're crying. Mom, where do we keep my wet weather gears? Honey, I don't even know where we keep the bread. Why is he a spoon? I've never felt this way about anyone. I want to do something for her, but what? Well, there's the usual thing, flowers, chocolates, promises you don't intend to keep. When Francis was propositioned by a fly. Hey cutie, wanna pollinate with a real bug? Don't worry about it, my dreams were shattered years ago! How many years ago? Uh, how old are you? <laughs> the time Norm's dad told him that he used to hear him slapping his tail in the bathtub all the time. I was just washing my tail, I swear! Dust for Prince! I found Prince! Uh, no, 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 Finger Prince! I don't think so. This is crazy. <laughs> so it was you who made the floor slippery, wasn't it? Dang, guess it's taken its right to remain silent. I mean, I am just a dumb bunny, but we are good at multiplying. <laughs> Why else would we run around in colored undies? I can think of three good reasons. After a tiring day, you could go to this motel from Morocco's modern life. No tell motel with Wawa beds. The rowdy rough boys had two dads and nobody had a problem with it. One of them was even a cross-dressing devil lobster. Did anyone complain? Nope. I did not know the devil lobster thing was a dude, actually, but I guess I haven't seen the show in a while. Say, sweet cheeks, what's your sign? Stop. The best time to wear a striped sweater is all the time. Wait, is this some dirty reference that I don't get? Dr. Lipsticks says it's a girl. Well, you know what they say, born under Venus, look for a... Hello? 
Yeah, good. Do not finish that. Uh. You probably missed that Stinky from Hey Arnold was a part of the Illuminati. Whoa, deep man. I thought the Earth wasn't supposed to move until the honeymoon, if you know what I mean. How about a ride? You like that car more than me. Who's talking about cars? Whoa, okay, man. It's alphabet soup. I made it special. F you. Yeah, that, that totally happened in the episode. That's true. Uh, go rewatch it. Totally happened. Anyway, subscribe. Uh, bye.